Yeah, let me preach. Let me preach. Maybe again, you know, part of, of um, this whole journey, I feel like I have been, I have a pull towards gospel, you know, ministry salvation. Maybe that's part of it. Maybe in Takuda Kua, pastors come out, the minister. <laughs> and it's the weirdest thing because no one would have expected that of me from me. No Maybe one, my sister, but not. To answer me. No one to answer me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's the most unlikely people who um get on that path. Because hey, Mtwang Yambia ten years ago at the Utaokoka. I'd be like, who? Who? Me. Who? <laughs> yeah. So um. Yeah, maybe, maybe there's there's that journey too. I'm looking forward to to see what that unfolds and what that entails. Yeah. Mm. Right. How much of uh, how much of the course? Mm-hmm. Can you share? What cause? It's the cause, the cause for for all this. So there's a reason behind all this. Behind all this. Oh. Oh yeah. <laughs> of what? The the whole um salvation, ama? No, no, no. Oh, the 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 journey. Yes. Oh yes. What the what's it called? This. What has caused me to get on this journey? Like um the the whole spiritual thing is. Mm-hmm. Is that what you mean? No. Mm. I mean, <laughs> you know, <laughs> he, he, you know what the force is about. Yes. Mm. So yes. Would, would, you, would you want to share that information now, like now? Yeah, Why we're doing this? No. no. Not now. We'll do that at the last episode. The last episode. <laughs> Good. <laughs> last episode. Nakuru. <laughs> yeah. Nakuru. Yes, Nakuru. Yeah, back to Nakuru then. When he left rehab. When he left rehab. Yeah. Then he stopped supporting. Yeah, he stopped. Um, he stayed in Nairobi for a while, mm-hmm. and then he came to Kericho. Mm-hmm. And then um, on my daughter's birth week, mm-hmm. like birthday in March, mm-hmm. it's the first week of March. Mm-hmm. I call. We had made plans on him joining us in Nakuru and then we celebrated together. Mm-hmm. We've made plans to make Ubaliana and Ninini Kila Kitu. Mm-hmm. On the day of him coming, mm-hmm. because um my sister was leaving Kericho, so I asked him if he wanted to, to come with them or if he's going to come by himself. Mm-hmm. So I've called my sister. For them the plan is still on intact, like they were on the way. Mm-hmm. So I call him. Drunk voice. Mm. The one that you know. <sighs> Drunk voice. Mm. I was like, hey, what the fuck? today, yes. <laughs> today. Of all days. Of all the days. I was so disappointed. I, that's my true. I let me stop. Keep hoping that you know things will change or that attach a pombe. You know, things like that, because I kept wishing and hoping that that would... I know that alcoholism is a disease. Mm-hmm. I know that. Mm-hmm. And I know it's hard to fight because Nimekua, like on the first um, receiving end, not receiving, yeah, receiving end, like I was married to an alcoholic spouse. Mm-hmm. I said was. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we were living together when he was an active alcoholic, so... You moved on really well. <laughs> Really fast, <laughs> and that is all. That is all things are about. Broken things are about moving on. Yeah. Well and cling on things. Yeah. No, no, a very bad cost to you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. So, I know how hard it is. I know how difficult it is. So, see, I think it's when you're not able to see what. I love on a watch. Yeah. Mm. But I had also seen him putting in the effort. Mm. On, on his sober days, like I, I saw how he would put in the effort. And this didn't feel like he was putting in any effort. Because he, he didn't use, to, because um, before, whenever he'd get the urge, he'd probably call me and then we'd talk, talk it out, like, you know, um, talk and then 
maybe by the time we're done the urge ime ime ime, ime shuka kid- no no ime isha isha ange <laughs> for, always there yeah, for, for that for that, that day, duration yes for that duration. yeah like it peaks and then it's so he didn't i didn't feel like he made any effort in trying to stay clean and that was too soon for him to to get back into alcohol like six months he meant that we go Evo too. Ah, that's in though. That is when I think I stopped communicating with him. Like I stopped making any effort in trying to communicate because I was like, I if six months he meant that to heal you, how can I? There's no way I can make him like you know get back on on his feet and like hakuna. So to can lea kukana kuru. Um, schools closed to Kakauko. And then when schools were about to reopen, hmm. no, I'll not talk about the school. <laughs> but yeah, there was a reason why I pulled her out of that school. <laughs> Something happened. In school. In school, yeah. So that's when I also decided. my sister on shule. It might not be inclusive, but um, I feel like she would be more taken care of. Uko. So I came to come back, and then you know, for her safety and just for me to to be okay, knowing that she's okay. So that's the main reason why I left. And then there was that political issue thingy. And then yeah, oh yeah, it's not my finances at that point. Yeah, my finances kept doing this. <laughs> So coming back to Kericho, I didn't find a, a house. And then my relatives were like, so really turn your money because no one is home and you'd keep them company. Now my grandmom. So I came back home. What month is this? In June. Yeah, June. June. So I came back and my granddad was, he was in hospital at that time. I stayed home for two weeks and then he came home. And then was it two or three days later he passed away. Yeah, that was the first, um, is it close, close death, like a relative of mine, like immediately related. Nilikuwa nienda ya yeah you know uh, there's an uncle a grandfather an aunt we took him but that was the first immediate and it did something to my walk off <laughs> it did something to it ah but that dog oh hey okay mbona kiulizi mmm hapo unajua history imekuwa imefika so recent yeah kuna vitu mingi zimefanyika between nakuru na i went home uh, <laughs> so, you summarize it like that, I'm going to get you into the details. Okay, take me back. What have I skipped? I will go to Nakuru. Will you end up Will you end up home straight? I have an aunt in Salga. That's where I stayed, I think, for a few days and then came home. Came home? Yeah. Hi, that's what I'm going to do for you. Home. Okay, now, see, for you, for me, I'm going home. Yeah. Komadi ni home. Yeah. Taon ni home. Yeah. Where did you go? <laughs> <laughs> no, I came here. Oh, you came here? Yeah. Okay. Mm. Reception. What have you done? Provox here? Of course. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah. You have to go to Yes. Okay. Very right, good. So, break your wanga? Yeah, Hapa. home. Hapa. Right. Reception. It was okay. Who was there? My grandma and the helps. Ah, okay, so that was okay. Yeah, uh-huh. it was okay. And then you stayed for... It's, it's my granddad who didn't used to want me here. Mm. You stayed for how long? Two, two weeks? Two, two weeks, weeks, yeah. Then he came back from hospital? Yeah. Um, how was he, hey, twice? Bad. What? It was bad. Yeah. Two, you stayed for two weeks, your grandpa came back? Mm-hmm. From hospital, 
then you passed on after how many days? Three. Three days. Mm. Those three days, how did you guys interact? The first day was okay. The second day. Is your Kwanza? Is your Kwanza, yeah. Of course, I can't complain. Why am I here? <laughs> Why are you here? Yeah. Hmm. He said, "Hataki watoto when you are alia." Yet my children don't Ooh, cry. Oh, 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 oh. That was his angle. Do some guy know what I mean? Ah! I don't know. I don't know. No, it's this is actually home. This is where I grew up. Yeah. That's it's not. It's not like my my actual home. Ati apa ni lizali wa hapa no. Uh, this is where I grew up. Exactly. It's not this like is where I grew up. It's not like you've known another home. Yeah. So, so what did he mean by why unofanya nini apa? Okay. According to him, yeah, according to him, where were you supposed to be? My husband's home. So all this time ukiwa na kuru, ukiwa site, hakuwa na jua, ukiwa ilan. I think he knew but I think he thought that I'd go back to my husband's home. Or maybe he expected. You know, when he was kicking me out of his house, the townhouse, mm-hmm. I think he thought that I wouldn't have any other option but to go back to my husband's house. And then each at each point when he when he kicked me out of his house, I didn't go to my husband's house. I went to my mom's. Mm-hmm. When he followed up with me to be kicked out of there, I didn't go to my husband's house. I went to a rental house. Mm-hmm. You know, how can I I can go to a rental house or yeah, how can I feel that he... Yeah, no, not even options. Like, I, I don't think he, he thought that I'd go to a rental house. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> mm. Ah, yeah, those three days. <laughs> yeah. So, who are you going to find Yeah, who are you going to find in Yapa? Staki was trying to get a little That's it. And I was like, okay, it's, it's not like I'm planning on staying here, living here. Not not just staying here, living here because I did not unpack my stuff. Ah, you were on your way. Yes, meaning I joined Konjiani. This is not. It's no longer my home. This is where I grew up. It's not my home. Yeah, so I did not unpack anything. <laughs> just my children's clothes, Nikeko Koko wardrobe. You too. Not even my clothes, just my children's clothes, here too, just for it to be easier to get to them because I change them twice or a week, a, a day or twice, or, ah, twice or three times a day, you know. So I needed them closer. And at that point, we can't make choker living out of a suitcase because this entire two years we were living out of a suitcase and I was just tired. <laughs> so I was happy to be back to a wardrobe. I'm like, oh. I can see all the clothes. <laughs> I'm there. Yeah. So, Sazile, so grandfather, there's a position about you being here. Mm-hmm. So, she wants some money? No, no. She's, she's never, like, um, gone against him or the talk back. I think Ali Nyamaza too. Mm. My grandma. No, she didn't tell me anything. Let us see and I'll name your story. <laughs> so, your grand, your grandpa mm. never actually got to talk to you until. He didn't tell me. No, directly. he didn't tell me directly. No. So he just said mm. he passed the message. Yes. Yeah. And then he got there. Of got course. To yeah. Did you leave? No. He didn't tell me directly to talk about Nyumba. So. <laughs> I stayed. Tokode? For him being home. Mm. Too. Me too. Mm-hmm. Anything else? He got unwell and then he was admitted in hospital. Oh, yeah, so. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Mm. <laughs> that was it. He got unwell. 
and then uh, the next day after him being admitted we were to all go like the grandchildren not the children we were all to all go and donate blood because he needed blood okay. we are all O's oh. yeah so to meditate the next day we not nenda to donate blood at 630 because that's when my my grandma wakes up early so I woke up at 630 I was going to help her prepare breakfast because the in-house help at that point had had been let go so there wasn't anyone in the house with her it was just me and her and, the, and my, my daughters and now akuna vile i can attend na lala my grandma nani ananitengenezea chai yeah yes so when i was i was going to open the, the door to go downstairs i hear my dog like men of shikilevi mlango the door, the door is being banged from outside. I'm like, hey, I'm going to go to my family. I'm going to go to my family. So I open the door and it's our neighbor, uh, the driver's wife. And I'm like, I'm going to go to my family. She's like, I'm going to go to my family. I had cups. Um, my, my daughter's cup that she drinks uh, milk before bed. So I had her cup. Then the neighbor's wife took the cup and put it back on the dresser. I was like, Nini? <laughs> so when I'm telling her, Nini, I hear my grandma crying downstairs. I'm like, oh my God. Nikasema <laughs> too, whoa. That's my grandfather. Like I just knew. Shuka stairs, the first landing, no, no, what? Sitting room. Like almost 10. What are you going to I was like, <laughs> Oh. Okay, why we love you? <laughs> like the whole, yeah. like what am I doing? So for me at that point, like they're trying to 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 hold me at your point. I'm like, what are you doing? But no, no, no. Yeah. My grandmother was crying. The focus is elsewhere. I'm like, my grandmother is crying, yeah. and not just the the. No, she was crying loudly. Yeah. Like boy, that's your manalia. I was like, let me go to her. Let me let me just what are you doing? Okay. So I went to her. And then when I was about to sit down in Ona, such the curtains had been drawn. There were about to see how many cars out there. I'm like, how what will just stand up because and because it's six. Yet there's so many people out here. Nikama will kwa ngoja. Yeah, because my, my Batem is one who was drawing the curtains. So I think they were just waiting to see the first movements in the house and your like they were just packed outside. They were just there outside. I hear that some came like from my